So after I cleanse my face, I go straight to a toner. This is a BHA toner from Cozer X. I've used two bottles of it already and I really love it. Especially if I'm having all this oiliness. You should try this one. It's a crowd favorite. Next up is the Centella Relief uh, Toner from Numbuzin. I've been loving Numbuzin lately. And this one, it is in a pad form. And there's a, for hygiene purposes, you've got a, a small tool you can use. And so you just get the pad, put on your face, the green pad, or the green areas where the centella is concentrated. The other side is, I believe, a moisturizing area. You just spread it all over your face. I usually leave it in an area of my concern at this time, my pimple, from working all those nights. So you should try it. Next one is a Numbuzin, I think the number is 6. Yeah, it's a sleep, a sleeping mask. I really love this one. If you do the night shift, this is very good. So they say, they claim that it replaces your... Um, face face masks and i think it really has moisturized my skin especially in days that i feel really really dry and if i'm too tired i definitely have to use this one because i know skincare routine usually takes a lot of time so i'm gently tapping it although it doesn't look like it but yeah so you should try this one so on to the next product we've got here the ordinary the retinol one so i don't use this every every day i use it at least once or maximum twice a week because it's it can be irritating to your skin if you use it frequently and especially if you go out in the day the next day you need to really really um, be good with your sunscreens so although it's very runny it can be quite sticky so i usually let it sit for a while before i go on to the next product so for the next product we have the effaclar duo from la roche posay I'm sure I'm not saying that right, but that's what we have. So this one, you just get a little bit of product and it goes a long way along with other uh, products we have here on our list. So this is actually intended as a spot treatment, but me and along with the other people, the, we've been using it all over our faces because it actually also claims to prevent further breakdown and it also i think it did it does in a certain level so going on for another portion just on the concentrated area on my area of pimple and some bit there because we're working working the night so so we're back with numbazin as you can tell there's nothing left i need to buy more of these baby and so we'll just have to use the next best thing which is the clears midnight calming cream which is more or less the same but probably more concentrated and i believe it really helps with redness i've mentioned it in a previous video before it can be a bit pricier compared to the other one but this is what we have here and let's use what we have in stock so like always just a little bit product goes along i think i've applied too much but don't worry we'll just spread it all over our face to make sure none of it goes to waste next one we've got the pimple patch am and pm um version so we've got different sizes there actually this is not my first pimple patch i've got the one from poser x which i still love but i tried the local ones i can find in our a local chemist or a local pharmacy drugstore whatever you call it and as you can see i've got some areas that need a little bit more tlc it's not opened yet but i love to cover it with pimple patches so that i don't accidentally touch it or i don't keep on touching the area just for hygiene purposes so the same thing with this one 